Um, I mean, in terms of results from last year to this year, um, we uh, we we want to be playing in November and into December. Um, we we got a national tournament bid last year, which was a good uh, reward for the boys, and and it's definitely something that uh, that we want to strive for again this year. And then obviously within the conference, challenging for trophies. We've got a good returning class. Uh, Fabian Egbele, Jan Lavica, both those guys were probably two of our most durable, most consistent players over the last couple of years. So having those guys back is a, is a good bonus for us. Um, you know, when when I talk about the seniors, we've got Evan Enders, who was all conference, all region player for us. Josh Thomas was our leading assist maker last year. Um, players like Colton Johnson have stepped up from a leadership standpoint for us over the summer. Um, Stian and um, Chris Page, both we expect valuable contributions for, for us, uh, again, leadership wise as well as on the field. Um, and, um, and in terms of the returning players that are the lower classmen and the new boys coming in, um, we feel like we've got some pieces in there that are going to be valuable contributors again this year for us and um, we'll, uh, we'll let their, their actions do the talking. Um, of our impactful newcomers, we've got um, Romeo, who's uh, a transfer from the ACC, who we obviously expect to bring some good experience to the team. Um, a couple of transfers from overseas that we think uh, that could be good impacts for us. Um, we graduated a couple of key pieces last year, so um, from the defensive side, um, we've got um, one or two boys, Mikel, Stian, that um, that we think will challenge right away. And um, uh, from the uh, attacking side, um, one of the boys, Solomon, who's who's um, going to be a good contributor from a um, uh, a wide area, also from a central area. Uh, we think again would be will be a good addition for us. I mean, the conference itself speaks for itself. It has done over the last few years. It's uh, it's the most challenging conference we believe, um, top to bottom, in the country. And um, you know, it, we don't think it's going to be any less than that this year. We've got Emery Riddle and PBA who are both full members this year, so uh, we think it's going to be a very challenging year for from a conference standpoint. From the non-conference teams. Uh, we open up with Francis Marion, who traditionally are very talented, and uh, we think that will be a good home opener for us. Um, we play shorter, opening weekend, which is another big regional game. And then we're on the road the following weekend. We play uh, Auburn Montgomery and Alabama Huntsville, and again, they're two big regional games for us. Well, as I said, we've got, um, you know, we graduated a couple of important pieces leadership wise last year. and. Um, you know, this preseason we plan to, to to have some fun with the boys and, and break the ice with the new boys coming in. Um, but the focus, for sure, in building leadership, team spirit, those are those are vital pieces for us every year, and, and this year will be no different. So we're going to spend some time this preseason focusing in that area.